Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with a full case of 2018 Panini Donruss Optic Baseball 12 box. Pick your team number four. This may be the last break um, that I ever do, ladies and gentlemen. So this might be it. Why, you ask? What's going on? Am I quitting? No. Am I fired? No, not yet. Got Mega Millions right here. Your luck will be changed today. This might be my last break. I'll, I'll probably still break. All right, there you go. Pick your team four. Pick your team five is in the store. Dustin, thank you very much. Last Spot Mojo, Diamondbacks. And there's everybody else. Oh, yeah, I, I was talking about what I was going to build with my lottery winnings. I would have a batting cage where the backgrounds can be slid out like a theater, like a theater pr production. And like the background would be like the brick at Wrigley Field, the green monster. Like the, you can see the bridge behind like PNC at PNC Park. You see the bridge is there. So I did be slidable backgrounds for the more iconic stadiums. The brick from Camden Yards. The waterfall at Anaheim Stadium. Bill Mosher says, with my lottery winnings, I should break from my Malibu beach house. That's right. And we changed the uh, we changed the channel name to, instead of Jaspi's Hobby Land, it would be Breaking With My Beaches. <laughs> All right, box number one. Right, right, right. The Arch in St. Louis would absolutely have that background. Stephen K says, people always think change is a good thing, Joe. It rarely is. I would like to change from being a millionaire to a multi-millionaire. I'm okay with that change. I think I can handle it. If the change includes a natural grass miniature golf course, I'm okay with that change. If that change means... Breaking from, from Malibu. I'm okay with that. Actually, I don't like Malibu, Bill. It's a weird, it's kind of a weird place. A lot of traffic up PCH. A lot of weird people there. Malibu's like weird. <laughs> there's like, there's like a weird La La Land up there. Yeah, I'd go Manhattan Beach. I'd live next to like, I'd live next, live next to like Nomar and Mia Hamm and hang out with them. Yeah, I'd move to Manhattan Beach. Yeah, I live next to Alex Morgan. Maria Sharapova used to live in Manhattan. I don't think she lives here anymore. She might still live here. Oh, Michelle. I don't think Michelle, we ever lived in Manhattan Beach. Sharapova Sher definitely did. Kershaw and his wife used to live in Manhattan Beach for a little while. California's gonna take all that money from me. I'm I'm happy to do. I'm happy with that. If I end up with two hundred million dollars after the four hundred million dollar Mega Millions, I'm okay with two hundred million. I'm not greedy. Tax me, California. I'll pay for this. I'll pay the extra for the sunshine, Stephen K. Property tax are ridiculous here, though. But then I would. Then again, I just I won Mega Millions, so I'll just pay it. All right, box number one. Give myself some room here. Bryce Harper. Now remember, there's two autograph hot boxes and two um, pr uh, parallel hot boxes. There's rated prospect for the Angels, Kevin Maiton. This is a this is a definitely a keeper, Angels. Jeremy Tillman. This could be this could be one of the bigger names in the hobby once he starts working up the ranks. It's out of seventy five. Uh, Bill says I was talking to my sister about winning the lottery. She said I would become I don't know who Dan Blizzarian is. I want to be offended, but I begrudgingly said, admit she was right. I don't know who that person is. Felix Jorge. 
Gilo says, I would pay Machado. To I wouldn't pay Machado to stay. I'd buy a piece of the Dodgers and then convince him to stay. Pay Machado. You got to think big, Gilo. You're, if you're a mega millionaire, you got to think big. You got to think buying, buying a piece of the Dodgers. Mound levels, Corey Kluber. 15 out of 99. That goes to the Tribe. Mount Marvel's Corey Kluber to 149. Patrick Goodwin, I'm I'm not listening to you. I'm not responding to your your bad baseball takes anymore. Just buy the San Francisco Giants and just tank. No, but then who would be? I, I need a good rival. I would I would I would I would not tank the Giants. Felix Jorge goes to the Twins. That'll be for Jeremy Anderson, by the way. Blazarian is a Vegas poker whale who surrounds himself with Instagram models. In my head, I literally thought of an actual whale, like the animal, <laughs> surrounded by Instagram models. That's how my head works, folks. T-Pain made a song about him? Oh, okay. I like T-Pain. If I, I, I don't know if I'd be down with Instagram models, though. I feel like at that level, I just get like, like Victoria's Secret angels to hang out with me, not like Instagram models. Anyone with a, with, with 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 a camera, with an iPhone, and a good makeup artist, and you know, can be an Instagram model. Not anyone can be a Victoria's Secret angel. Oh, nice, Stephen K. He'd accumulate the ultimate 1952 top set. I would too, actually. William L. says elitist. Right, yeah. I would, I would be. Instead of, instead of buying Fiji water, William L., I just buy Fiji water company. I don't know if I'd buy the island. I feel like that's a money pit. The island of Fiji, probably a money pit. Fiji water, not a money pit. I would buy Fiji water or a stake in it, I guess. I guess I don't want to buy the whole thing. It's a lot of responsibility. All right, next box. First autograph is Rafael Devers. Nice. Rated rookie autograph. Yeah, definitely scared money. Absolutely. <laughs> Would not buy the island of Fiji or in, or all of Fiji water. Although Fiji water has to be owned by someone, right? It's not just, just old, little old Fiji water by themselves. All right. Rafael Devers goes to Jeffrey S. and the Red Sox. And backwards, Mike Trout. So if you look at – usually the variations are backwards like this, but you can also tell by the, uh, by the black baseballs on the back. Usually they have – that's a rated rookie. Let me find you a different example right there. Usually they're that. But these will ship obviously because these are variations. I don't know what kind, but they are some sort of variation. All right, so we'll sleeve that up. Uh, Josh Donaldson will probably be moved, Sam. Don there, there he is right there, Sam Roll. Yeah, he probably will be moved. I can't see them holding on to him, right? It might be the last year of his contract. They should probably move him. We'll save an Otani. What is rent like in Manhattan Beach? I won't have to rent anymore, Bill. I'm buying. No more rent. Rent. $2 million condo. Tyler Wade, Yankees, Robert Throne. Uh, 
There you go, rated rookie Tyler Wade. Joe, you could buy Tim Hortons and turn into a break shop. What's what? What is a Tim Hortons? Out of one ninety nine, Laser Show, Dustin Pedroia. Boombox would take lottery Mega Millions winnings. Drawings tonight, folks. We're gonna find out if I'm a winner tonight. So stay tuned, folks. Could be my last break night ever. Well, maybe I'll come back in a couple weeks. I'll take a couple weeks off. There's Gary Sanchez for the Yankees. Reggie Jackson Refractor. We'll save that different Otani. There's Bellinger and there's Bautista. Now, Boombox says he would take his Mega Millions and would move to Nigeria, then try to give away most of your winnings by emailing strangers. A prince among men. Boombox. Next box. Do the do the Cardinals need Do the Cardinals need a Josh Donaldson though? Um Don't you want is, don't you want Josh Donaldson in the uh in a DH spot maybe? Tim Horton sells coffee and donuts and Timbits. I don't know what Timbits are. But I don't know why I would buy a coffee shop, what amounts to be a Dunkin' Donuts, I guess. Why would I buy that and turn that into a break operation? Patrick Goodwin, you got you got you gotta you gotta bake your ideas a little bit more in that oven, sir. Well, I guess you're just twelve, so I suppose that makes sense. Does <laughs> Dead Mouse has a huge I would buy a Dead Mouse helmet. But he has a huge Tim Horton sign on his side. Where does Dead Mouse live? Didn't he put Skrillex's cell phone number on a, on a t-shirt one time? We saw that, TJ. That was a nice clean hit. Bill Mosher would buy, with his Mega Millions money, would buy a house in the Greek Isles and open a beachfront bar. That's not bad. I would buy the the Dodgers single A team, the Rancho Cucamonga Quakes. I would buy that team and then I would uh, buy a helicopter and helicopter from Santa Monica Airport to Ontario Airport whenever I wanted to see a game. I would do that. Maybe I'd maybe I would would uh would open a a bar or club, maybe in Ibiza. There's Reese Hoskins, out of one forty nine for the Phillies. You know what, Megan? I think they do. Does Tim Horton have a hockey card set? Eloy Jimenez, Chicago White Sox rated prospect autograph. This is another one. This is another big prospect right here. In addition to Kevin Maiton. White Sox, that would be Brian Sawyer. They got him from the Cubs, if you guys remember that. Stephen Kay would move to Scotland, proclaim himself the rightful descent of William Wallace, and wage war against the British? Hmm. Would that be would would that be a wise thing to do, Stephen Kay? I think that's been kind of settled for a little while. Out of 125, there's Tyler Wade. And then I can hear Stephen K saying, I can fight. And then I'd be like, Stephen K, I know, I know you can fight. But it's our wits that make us men. Rated rookie out of 125, another one for Robert Throne and the Yankees. There's Verdugo. Rhino and Kershaw. There's Giancarlo Stanton. 
and Clayton Kershaw Refractor, and future Ace Walker Bueller. Stanton out of 199. Stephen Case, if you're going to dream big, you got to dream big. That's true. Fair enough. Out of 299, Rhino. Rex says, I heard moving to Puerto Rico is a smart move because there's no taxes and property is cheap. Rex, I dis I mean, maybe that's the case, but I would rather live in the greatest country in the world, the United States of America, and be happy to pay taxes to the greatest country in the world. Right, Boombox like, also... Water electricity issues in Puerto Rico. Paul Hutchins said, I would buy Binghamton Rumble Ponies and just change that stupid nickname and charge and stop charging four fifty for medium Coke just because of Tebow. Puerto Rico, Puerto Rico is the United States kind of... I don't know. It doesn't have a star on the flag yet. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna stay in California and then just travel everywhere else. I could just go to Puerto. I could just take my take my Joe Joe copter. Take my Joe copter to to Puerto Rico anytime I want to. My Joe plane. <laughs> Rex Rex says not. Well, I, I know Rex. We're just, we're just having a laugh. Rex like, that's not true. Parts are doing just fine. Rex really sold on the Puerto Rico idea. He's getting defensive about it. He's just like, hey, stop knocking Puerto Rico. It's fine. All right, Rex. So we know what Rex is going to do with his Mega Millions. What about what about everyone else, folks? Mega Millions is at $400 million tonight. I've got three sets of numbers. And this may be our my last break night for a little while after I win the $400 million. And then lump sum it. you got to lump sum it. There's Nick Williams. Actually, I haven't seen one of these yet. I'll save those. And there's Andrew Benintendi. Looks like some sort of variation right there. That $400 million won't last long with a copter and a plane? Maybe I'll rent rent those things. Fine, I'll just rent the planes then, Stephen K. All right. Ronald Acuna, rated... Pro We've seen a lot of nice rated prospects autograph in this case so far. For the Bravos, Jeremy Tillman with Ronald Acuna, rated prospect. 8 out of 50. Oh, remember, ladies and gentlemen, the, uh, the, I posted a fresh case of this. So if you miss out on your teams for the first handful of breaks... Don't miss the next ones. And then we've got a few more cases after that, ladies and gentlemen, so there'll be there'll be plenty for you. Kirby Puckett out of two ninety nine. There's Giancarlo Stanton, Ahmed Rosario, and points. We'll collect these. We've only, usually when we see points, it's only one per case or something like that. But um, if there are any more, winner take all on those. And that, of course, takes the place of that second autograph. All right. Next box, ladies and gentlemen, good luck.
wait, Paul Hutchins, what did uh, what did they what did they charge for a medium Coke before Tebow, pre Tebow? And I would not be paying players, Bill Mosher. No, no way. I'd be buying pieces of, of professional sports franchises. So you, Paul says usually just a couple of bucks for that soda, but the Tebow effect, $4.50. That's kind of brutal. I think Tebow gets called up. He has to, right? Mets are having a terrible season. They'll call him up in September, right? September call it's when rosters expand. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll go through some baseball scores, uh, maybe next box, Patrick. Stay tuned for baseball scores in the next box. Don't go anywhere. For your Friday, July 20th, 2018, baseball scores, a little after 6.45 p.m. Pacific. Bill Mosher saying, Joe, this is the LeBron effect. I will not be missing a second of Lakers basketball this year. It's going to be riveting. It is. Either for the, either for the train wreck potential of it. Or, uh, I don't know, or maybe the actual success of it. Who knows? Joe Flores. Oh, that's a good call. I would definitely – season tickets for, for, for your favorite sports franchises? Absolutely. So if they don't want to sell you a piece of their franchise, yeah, I would buy season tickets. There's Mike Trout to 199 for the Angels. We got Clint Frazier, rated rookie autograph for the Yankees. Nice one for Robert Throne. Do I think Tebow will get a pro card? Yes. I think I think Tops and uh, Panini can't wait for Tebow to make his pro debut so they can they can get him in there. Uh, there's Anthony Stan Stanenter. Santa? Santander. I can't, why can't I pronounce that? Anthony Frank. It's Corey Kluber. And Giancarlo Stan, 2017 MVP card there. Why is my why is my completely legal stream not streaming properly? Streaming the Dodger game properly. Come on now. I just have to refresh the page. All right. Next box. Good luck. How how is Tebow how is Tebow doing? What what is he what is he hitting? Paul saying that there is a sold out game tonight, but Tebow not selling as many tickets as they hope because the same's not in a very nice neighborhood. And those four dollar and fifty cent medium cokes aren't going to help either. That's what I hear, TJ. The T TJ who is in. Director of mar merchandising over at the Tulsa Drillers, the Dodgers Double A team, saying the Tebow effect has a much wider reach than just the tickets. Their merch numbers are probably off the charts too. That's what I hear. Tebow, good, good, good for minor league ballparks. Uh, final scores in baseball. Just one final today. Cardinals pounding on the Cubs, eighteen to five. We got some games that are close to finishing up. We've got the Marlins leading the Diamond Marlins leading the Rays 6-1 in the bottom of the ninth, Tampa Bay's last frame. Red Sox holding on to narrow 1-0 lead over the Tigers in the bottom of the seventh. Bottom of the ninth. Uh, Orioles and Blue Jays are tied at sevens. Bottom of the seventh. Phillies leading the Padres in Philadelphia 7-5. I think we have the Mets-Yankees game on our TV right now. Top of the seven, Mets leading 6-3.
Bottom of the eighth, Braves leading 8-5. On the Nats, I think I've got the Braves in that game. And then games are kind of in the middle. Cleveland and Texas are tied at three. My Dodgers in Milwaukee with Manny Machado. Tied at one in the bottom of the sixth. Rich Hill still on the mound. Um, I don't know what Manny Machado's other at-bats were. KC leading the Twins, 3-1, bottom of the fifth. And then uh, San Francisco, the Giants are in Oakland. Just went across the Bay Bridge. Bottom of the first, that just started. And top of the first, Colorado Rockies with an early 2-0 lead over the Diamondbacks. All right, Marcelo Zuna, red. Ryan Braun, blue. This looks like a parallel hot box right here, ladies and gentlemen. To 99, to 149, to 299. Nice. Severino to 199. And there's David Wells. Optic autographs for the Toronto Blue Jays. Was David Wells on the Blue Jays? I don't remember David Wells on the Blue Jays. Trivia, David Wells was born right near here. Oh, that was his first team and his two, three, four, five, and, and his team after the Yankees as well. There he is, David Wells, Toronto Blue Jays. That'll be for Jeremy Tillman. It's crazy. That was his, that was his first team. All right. We got Diamond Kings Bryce Harper to 299. We got Chris Sale to 50. Nolan Arenado out of 149. Adam Jones, orange, out of 199. Where does Adam Jones end up? Harrison Bader out of 299. Ryan Braun to 299. Charlie Blackman for the Rockies out of 99. Nolan Arenado, All Stars out of 149. Victor Robles to 299. And Nicky Delmonico is your other autograph. Rated rookie auto for the White Sox. Brian Sawyer with the White Sox. And rated rookie red, Clint Frazier to 99. Trevor Story. To 299. Michael Fulmer to 199. Nomar Mazzara to 299. Freddie Freeman Diamond Kings to 199. Jose Bautista to 299. Um, Yoshi Hisi. Hisha? Hirano is your last one. There you go. And we'll sleeve all of these up. Bill saying the Brewers are going to do something big? What do you think the Brewers are going to do? They're about to do something big in this game. The bottom of the sixth, two outs. Rich Hill still on the mound. Man on first and second. Three and one to who, who is this? I don't know who is up to bat. Number nine on the Brewers, whoever that man is. Oh, Pena is at the plate. And he pops it up to left center field. Nice. Dodgers out of the inning. Still tied at one. All right, so we'll have one more parallel hot box to go after this. And we are halfway through the break, ladies and gentlemen. So 
So who else bought a uh, who else bought a Mega Millions ticket tonight? We're about an hour away from the drawing, an hour away from me taking uh, an extended vacation from case breaking, boys and girls. I'll be back though. I'll still break. I'll be back. Bill Moshe said I should win the Mega Millions for having to sleeve all those parallels. That's fine. That's okay. I, I don't have to sort this thing anymore. Back in the day, early days of Jaspies. Moving up in the world, folks. Don't have to sort the brakes anymore. I'm not greedy though. I'll take the um, I'll take the five numbers, no mega number, and take a million bucks. I'm okay with that. That's not like that's not like retire money, but I can make it work for a little while. <laughs> Oh man, they're doing the, uh, the 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 sausage race. I don't know who's gonna win. Games in Milwaukee. Striped shirt guy, leading. Chef right behind. I don't know if anybody's watching this game. If you have MLB TV, you should be able to watch this. Oh, no word on who who won. All right, next box. Good luck, everybody. Ken Griffey Jr. to 299. Remember that out of five autograph of Ken Griffey Jr. we pulled last night? I remember. And Walker Bueller. Walker Bueller for my Dodgers. EA with the future Dodgers ace. And Francisco Mejia, who was recently traded for Brad Hand, giving the giving the Indians a great back end of that bullpen. Michelle with the Mariners with that parallel. We got Gary Sanchez. All stars to ninety nine. Chipper Jones chip off the old block to one forty nine. What's the haps? Ian Hap and Wayno at the back. All right, next box. Good luck. No, no, no one else bought a no one else bought a Mega Millions ticket tonight. No one else is feeling lucky. I don't know. My my fortune cookie today told me there was some extra luck involved. I'm okay with that. Actually, clear myself some space here. All right, let's get comfortable. Here we go. Five boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. We're almost there. Let's see. How are my how are my MLB picks of the day doing here? I had Atlanta. I think they can do it. I had Minnesota. They're down by two against the Royals in the top of the sixth. I still have time to win that one. I've got the Rangers. Rangers are tied with the Indians at three. I feel I feel okay about that. Rain Texas is at home. So that gives me a little edge there. And the Rockies jumped out to an early two-nothing lead against the Diamondbacks in the top of the first. 
Still, still too early in the game to tell. And I took the, in the late game, or one of the late games, took the Astros over the Angels tonight. Those are my picks. We've got another case of this uh, Optic Baseball in the store. Pick your team number five. Fresh case, full case in the store. We've got plenty more of this. So if you miss out on your team the first handful of times, just keep an eye on the website, jazpiecehobbyland.com. Try to snag them the next time another fresh case goes up. Is this another parallel hotbox? This might be our second parallel hotbox. Excellent. Josh Bell, it's $2.99. Adrian Beltre, speaking of the Rangers, to 99. Carlos Martinez to 149. Arenado, 299. And Craig Nettles. Greg Nettles. Craig with a G. Uh, that goes to the Yankees. That'll be for Robert Throne. Chris Bryant to 199. Watch the throne. Carlos Martinez out of 299. Nolan Arenado All Stars to 99. Jose Ramirez out of 149. Arcia to 299. Dallas Keuchel, he's on the mound tonight against the Angels out of 199. Ryan Dozier for the Twins out of 299. Salvador Perez, Sal Perez to 50. Brian Dozier again to 149 for the Twins. Zach Granite, another one for the Twins out of 199. Jeremy Anderson racking up the parallels. And we've got Nick Williams. Eight out of 50. Bryce Harper to 149. Trey Turner to 99. J.D. Martinez to 199. Chance out of 299. Syndergaard to 199. Anthony Rizzo. 299. And then regular Bryce Harper Diamond Kings insert in the back there. That will still ship. Happy Friday, Who Cats. 81. Was that was that an error? Craig Nettles? Greg Nettles? Rex saying this is the break that never ends. You know, it, it is it is a long break, but these are one of those breaks that don't feel like it's an hour long because there's like a lot of a lot of parallels that pop out. A couple autographs of box I think helps a lot. There's always something visually uh, happening on the screen. For Curtis says it feels like two hours. Doesn't feel like two hours. Feels short to me. Name a longer break than Optic. A full case Allen and Ginter break is longer than Optic. It feels like uh, it feels like in your dentist chair when you're when you aren't in a break like this. That's why you should join a break like this, Rex. I mean that that break exists somewhere in the world, Curtis. Dylan Schmidt, new here. How do I find out when the pick your team Alan Aginter break is? I don't know either. Believe it or not, it'll break when it fills. I don't think it's even full yet. Is it full? No, there's still two teams left, Dylan Schmidt. 
the Rays for ten bucks, and the Twins for thirteen ninety nine. Now, if you if you were to buy one or both of those teams, then it, that break would happen right after this break. <laughs> Joe Flores says, if there was a full case break of Allen Ginsberg, I wouldn't know what to do if I wasn't in the break. Right, so Joe Flores would obviously join that break. Or take a break from breaks for like an hour and a half. <laughs> People complain about one box break of Star Wars Masterwork. People complain about everything, Curtis. I've been I, I've been I've been breaking for for many years now. I, I've just learned that everyone will complain about everything. Everyone everyone likes Skinter, hates Skinter, loves Optic, hates Optic. Wants more hockey, want less hockey, want more soccer, no soccer. Non-sports, sports. What are you going to do? You know, just keep buying stuff and join the breaks and try to pull some something fun. And we have a good time. I try to pull you some hits. And, we, and then we move on to the next one. Um, any guesses on this redemption? In fact... If you guess this redemption, I will give you five dollars of break credit. How about that? I'll take the I'll take the first three. I'll take the first three guesses. First three guesses. Uh, I don't think these those are very good guesses, but. Judge, Dustin Hughes, Chris Bryant, Rex, Verdugo, Joe Flores. I'll take the first three. All right, Ryan McMahon to two ninety nine, and then out of thirty five, Kyle Farmer. Nice one for my Dodgers. That goes out to EA Sports in the game. Sam Roll, if DJ Left Shark is the redemption here, I will give you twenty dollars of break credit. <laughs> Cody Ballinger to 149. See, now the break isn't as boring anymore, huh? All right. The redemption is bam. Jose Altuve, nobody was close. Verdu Judge, Chris Bryant, Verdugo. Unfortunately not, but a nice retro 1984 signatures hollow for the Astros. Adam Wilson with the Strohs. Sorry, Sam. No DJ Left Shark in here. And yes, he knows that's football. I, I know someone's going to be like, but that's football. Sam knows. Sam knows. Relax. Someone's listening out there, Sam Roll. You know it. You know it too. Someone's watching this video being like, but that's football. It's like, yeah, I know. Sam knows. It's just a joke. Just, 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 just having a laugh. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Third to last box. Almost there. Getting there. Getting there, folks. 
See that? See Nick Jaspi right there in the camera, folks? A rare Nick Jaspi sighting. You need like a like a a golden raspberry and like a ultra pokeball to catch that. Wait, what? <laughs> no one plays that game anymore. Random and pick your team Ginter sold out at the same time. I'll be the judge of that, Stephen K. We'll find out. Unless that person bought the last spot at the same time. So if the same person bought the last spot at the same time, then I don't know what's going to happen. Who knows? But I'll go through orders after this break, folks, and then we'll figure it out. All right. Good luck, everyone. Here we go. Nice Otani refractor of him running. Aaron Judge out of 149. And then we've got Signature Series Willie Adams. For the Rays, that goes to David Duffy. Any relation to Danny? Giancarlo Stanton out of 2.99, and Harrison Darth Bader going to the Cardinals. That's for the X line. And those last two boxes should be the autograph hot boxes, ladies and gentlemen. And out of this world, Giancarlo Stanton, two out of five. For the Yankees, Robert... Watch the throne all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. I've done four breaks. First two cases, one of one. Second two cases out of fives. These cases are, are pretty nice, ladies and gentlemen. We've got another case available, jaspieshobbyland.com. All right, good luck, everybody. Last two boxes. Dodgers up 3-1. Top of the seventh with bases loaded now with just one out. Machado two for two on the day. And two walks. Team K saying, I heard Darth Vader, not Harrison Vader, but Darth Vader, was just named the best movie villain of all time, Hannibal Lecter number two. Both are pretty terrifying. Hmm. Both are pretty terrifying. I would I, I would rather fall victim to Darth Vader though. I feel like uh, if I were to fall victim to any movie villain, it would be Darth Vader. That lightsaber will just cut right through you and you'd be like, it's a quick death. Hannibal Lecter, you know, you don't know what's gonna happen with that guy.
Right, yeah. Vader wouldn't eat my brain. I don't want Vader eating... Uh, Lecter would... Hannibal Lecter would eat my brain. I don't, I don't want that to happen. All right. The Brewers get out of that inning. Not too much damage. Here we go. Autograph hot box. We got a hot Dustin Fowler. That'll go to the Oakland A. Scott V with the Athletics. We've got Reyes Moronta. He's got a cool autograph. Rated rookie autograph for the Giants. TJ on the board. Out of 125, Tej. Rated rookie autograph, J.D. Davis. That'll go to the Astros. Strohs, Adam Wilson with the Strohs. Rhino to 149. And Mitch Carver to 125. That'll be for the Twins, Jeremy Anderson. Aaron Judge out of this world. And nice, Keith Hernandez, signature series autograph for the Metropolitans. That'll be for Rick T. I think one of, one of the best, good mustache, Keith Hernandez. Joey Gallo gold out of this world. That's for the Rangers. That should be out of 10, right? That is for the DVD. Six out of 10. Nice. And then the Aaron Judge is out of 149, maybe. Out of 149. There you go. Last box coming up. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Paul Hutchins, do you think it's fair to put the hot box in the same position in a case? Yeah, that's actually an interesting quest thing. Um, no, I don't, actually. Um, I think that opens uh, I think that opens the door to too much uh, too much shadiness. You can have you can have like shady local card shop guys, you know, pull those boxes out for those boxes to be sold on display. Take out the two autograph hot box and put the rest on. Dis I mean, who knows? You know what I mean? Like, case breakers could do that too. If you don't see a case breaker, do this break, and then have a, have at least the first video or whatever of the case being open and marked. You gotta wor you gotta wonder as well. You know, you gotta or or you gotta at least mix up mix up the boxes yourself. But yeah, I mean, I don't think it's like the end of the world. It's not like. Oh my God! This is this is a disaster. But I think I think next time I hope that there's 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 a little be better uh, better mixing. Although I'm sure there's a production reason why for that. Maybe my 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 guess has to be that that they just filled up the they filled up the case with the other boxes, left the two out, and then once those boxes were packed, they put them into the top of the boxes. That's, that's got to be my guess. But then again, the parallel hot boxes are a random, and they're guaranteed two per case. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe Hopefully next time they'll, they'll mix them up. But 
But I think now, as as from from your guys' end, the consumer end, you know, when you're joining when you're joining breaks, you got you can definitely keep an eye out for that, especially if they're they're not full case breaks. Something to look out for. Max Reed. That goes to Jeremy Tillman and the Braves. Max Scherzer, Mound Marvels to 99. And Willie Calhoun for the Rangers, who I believe just got called up. Former Dodger prospect. They moved him along. He's got cinder blocks for hands, but he can hit the ball a ton. There's Zach Granite. Every time I see this card like this, I, th I always think it's Zach Granke. Not Zach Granke, Zach Granite. And that's for the Twinkies. Jeremy Anderson with the Twins. And Hall of Famer, Alan Trammell. Significant signatures. That goes to Scott V and the Tigres. Nice. Should be one more. I think it's right there. There's Trout and Jimmy Scherfe. Diamondbacks. That goes to Dustin Hughes. Last spot mojo. Shooing the skunk away, Dustin. Nice. There it is. At least at least one. And that's that, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. The Trout Aqua, numbered to 299. The Mound Marvels Red should be out of 99. There it is, 92 out of 99. And consolation prize for someone, some points. So let's go to Rand.org. You're, you're welcome, Dustin. At least it's something. All right, name on top after four times. Two and two for the hard way. One, two, three, and four. Name on top after four times will be Robert Watch the Throne. There it is. A little extra 250 points coming your way. And there you have it, folks. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. That was pick your team number four. Number five is in the store right now on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.